Hi everyone, I hope you can hear me. Uh, I say everyone. Who knows if there's more than one person watching. We're gonna try, uh, we're gonna try streaming the forest tonight. Uh, the forest is the perfect game for streaming. Uh, oh, maybe you can save where you are now. Uh, let's see, last I knew, you couldn't actually save where you were. Uh, there was no save option, which was really strange, uh, to get used to. Uh, because, you know, you'd build these fucking nice things and then you'd, you'd just be shit out of luck. There was nothing you could do about it. Um, so, so, uh, Force is really great for this one-shot type of long-form episodes like streaming, uh, as opposed to YouTube where you'd break it up into 10, 20-minute episodes. Uh, so, it appears as though maybe you can, uh, save now? I'm not sure. Uh, Force has been out on Steam for a little while now. Uh, I picked it up the day it came out because I've been following the trailers and I'd been uh, super excited to play it. It looked like everything Rust should have been, uh, but more single player uh, minded as opposed to Rust where it's pretty much completely multiplayer minded. I feel like there's a middle ground there that both games sort of need to come to meet on. Uh, maybe I'm completely wrong though. I have I have no idea. Um, who knows? There's definitely a game in the future like that where, where that is Rust and the Forest, and it's together. And there's probably one out there right now that you can think of that you're thinking, uh, you know, culpable thumb. What about uh, so and so game? What about this game? What about what about this game? You're right. You're absolutely fucking right. You know what a good example is uh, that is also at the same time a fucking terrible example? Minecraft. Minecraft has a pretty good uh, single player mode and a pretty good multiplayer mode and it is definitely a survival buildy sort of thing here we go uh, I we're on a plane I don't know if you can see me uh, how's the stream doing stream looks like it's doing okay but my game is lagging quite a bit uh, I got my kid here sleeping on my arm hi kid how are you are you okay he seems okay uh, It does really have a horrendous sound, though. You do have to give it that. Uh, I'm hoping this is something that gets fixed in later uh, later updates. But, I mean, there's still like three elements. Ah, all right, we're landing. We're coming to the ground. Oh boy, oh boy. Okay. Uh, hopefully that will. Hello, big fucking weird guy. What are those on your? What are those on your belt? Ferns? Are those ferns? They look like ferns. You may be noticing some lag. Uh, it is in my game as well. Uh, it's really frustrating. I don't know what it is about the forest. The forest, I I really have to drop all my settings down to play. My PC is fairly decent. I can play most other games at fucking <laughs> ultra high settings. Uh, we are low energy, we need to eat something, figure some shit out. Let's just collect up everything we can. What do we got? We got soda. We got, uh... Something. I don't know. I don't know what all these are. Uh, okay, kind of clipping through there. Too bad we can't really see the, uh... Just grab everything. We kind of want to get the fuck away from here as quick as possible. Uh, because there are dudes... Who want to fucking eat us? All right, we got the axe. So let's just uh, let's just beat feet, uh, pretty much as quickly as possible. We're gonna run off in, in this direction, and we're just gonna sort of aim for uh, this way. Uh, we'll try to pick up whatever we can, whenever we can. But we don't want to really uh, stick around in one place too long because what happens is those little shits. Uh, tend to come up and, and ruin your whole day. And the next thing you know, you're stuck in a fucking cave and you're having to find your way around. And I found my way around once, but another time I did not do so well. Uh, I, in fact, what you could say I did was extraordinarily poor. <sighs> Alright, uh, I kind of want to get on the beach. I got the environment still popping up around me. Which is fine. Everything's running pretty smooth, actually. Uh, the first time I tried to record this, uh, this game, anyway, 
Uh, not everything wanted to run as smooth as it's running now. It uh, was kind of a mess, to be honest. I'll pick up that rock. We need rocks for building shit, so we'll pick them up while we can. I hear whistling. Is that those fucks following me? It's hard to tell. So there's natives on this island, okay? And they're following you. And they are trying to figure out what the hell just came screaming out of the sky. And what the hell is going on. And honestly, there are some fucking scary moments in this game. Um, moments that leave me a little bit tense. That I'm not entirely uh, comfortable with. However, I feel like uh, as someone who, who grew up playing scarier games. And, and spent the better part of the late 90s playing games like Silent Hill and Resident Evil. It's kind of welcome, because I feel like horror games have been fairly lax uh, as of late, and they've been all about flash and not about atmosphere at all. Whereas games like Silent Hill, and specifically Silent Hill 2, were almost entirely based on atmosphere and scary as fuck. Uh, I think anyone who's played Silent Hill 2 especially back when it came out uh, would agree with me that Silent Hill 2 is probably one of the scariest goddamn games ever created. Um, it's just a brilliant game. And I th uh, like I was saying, I think a lot of games tend to fall away from that now. They tend... Is that... Is that me? What the fuck was that? Why did that glitch like that? Can I break this rock? Can I do that? No? Okay. Who knows? I mean, a rust that can hit rocks with fucking anything, and they they smash apart. I'm I'm heading over toward the beach. I ran in the wrong direction. I really feel comfortable at the beach because uh, it's kind of out in the open, and uh, there there is a lot of of trees and shit all over the place. So that's where I'm going. Uh, at the same time, I'm I'm also trying to keep moving because I don't want to. I'm looking for dudes. I don't want to have to deal with uh, those fucking dudes, basically. Uh, if I can get myself a decent house, which I haven't been able to do yet in this game, hopefully, uh, you know, I won't have to. Hopefully, I can just uh, play comfortably on my own. I had heard rumors, and I'm not entirely sure how much truth there there is to it, uh, or if it's even late enough in the game to tell, that the devs were thinking of enabling a, uh, a sort of single-player peaceful mode where you would land on the on the island and you would uh, you just build. There would be no assholes trying to come kill you. I don't know if that's still happening. I don't know if that's still a thing. Maybe. Maybe. Who knows. Uh, it would be nice. I wouldn't mind playing it. But again, as much as the tension makes me uncomfortable, I'm kind of looking for the tension. Um, I enjoy it. Uh, so, I probably should have opened up my Twitch channel before I started recording, uh, before I started streaming anyway. I'm worried that if I pause now to go do that, uh, I'm going to fuck everything up. And, uh... Alright, we made it to the beach. So that's good. I'm going to take a second here. Get out to this island, I think. Look at that. That's beautiful. They'd have to swim out to me. Can I swim out there, or will I die if I swim out there? I'm going to try to, um... Open up my Twitch channel. Oh shit, I didn't want to open it. I clicked the wrong thing, so you're just going to have to listen to me babble while I do everything. I open up my snipping tool by accident, and uh... Well, I didn't want to, is what I'm getting at. Okay, let's, let's uh... Man, almighty. My computer is goddamn slow, though, when I stream. There's no, there's no two ways about it. Let's uh, get my Twitch channel open, just so I can set this shit up. Uh, how's your evening going? Uh, I am thinking uh, of calling all of my Twitch streams Cold Purple Thumb After Dark. 
because I generally only can stream, you know, after dark. <laughs> so I figure maybe some neon uh, lights say after dark on them would be nice. Maybe, maybe not. I don't really know. All right, I got my Twitch page up. I'm looking at it. Uh, I'm hoping some fucking guys don't come and kill me immediately. Let's pause that. Let's edit my thing here. Okay. All right. I've got my whole Twitch shit all set up, and we're back. Maybe. I'm back, but it doesn't look like my Twitch stream is back. There we go. Now my Twitch stream is back. Okay, uh, do we want to try to swim across here? Do we think that's a good idea? Is that a, a good idea, a bad idea? I'm not sure. I feel like uh, we're not going to have a whole lot of options pretty soon here. So we should uh, let's get around this rock here and... I want to get out on that island. That island seems like the ideal place to go, but I'm I'm worried that uh, I'll die if I try to swim out there. Maybe I should uh, just throw some rocks down and see what happens. What do you think? Hmm. It's kind of oh uh, shit. I'm in the water. Can I swim? Uh. Yeah, it looks like I can swim. I'm probably going to get hungry, though, and that worries me. So let's swim over to the shore. But now we know. Now we know we can uh, run over there and uh, and swim and build our little house. Now, I don't know if the other guys can swim. I would assume, since they're natives, they can. I'm also making a walking sound. I don't know if you can hear that. Let's get up back up, up on here. And we'll cut down some trees. Try to avoid some motherfuckers. Let's cut down this tree here. What's up, tree? Yeah, I'm here to cut you down. Now, one thing that I like about uh, the cutting down trees in this, as opposed to say Rust or uh, Minecraft, is that uh, it's way more realistic. In that, it doesn't burst into a handful of logs, or as a Minecraft, or when you're playing Rust. It uh, doesn't just add wood to your inventory. Where's it going? Where's it going? All right, straight down. Great. All right, look at all the shit we just got. Quite a b quite a bit of shit we just got. All right, so let's grab up all these logs. Uh, I think we take one or two at a time. Two. Okay. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna grab two and we're gonna run out here. Yep. We can do that, right? That I didn't lose my logs, did I? No, I didn't. I don't think I did anyway. We'll bring them right out here. Up to this island. And uh, hopefully we can survive and not have these fucking guys all up in our shit all the time. With any luck. Although I wouldn't uh, doubt that they can swim. I wouldn't doubt that they have fucking boats. And that they're just going to be like, yo. Hey, stupid, we have boats. <laughs> uh, because honestly, it's, is that a boat right there? Oh, damn it. Let's drop these logs. Stay there. Don't go rolling around. Alright, looks like they're going to stay there. I think I need to uh, start building some shit here. Is that a boat? It's pretty much not a boat. What else is up here? Anything cool? Lots of rocks. Nothing really that uh, impressive, though, to be honest. Alright, let's open up the uh, the guide. Yeah, blueprints, getting started, got it. Uh, shelters is what we want first. Uh, we need sticks and leaves to build most things. But we can also do sticks and logs to get a log cabin. Do you think we can make it to get a log cabin before we die? I think we can. We got two logs. We can probably do this, right? Or am I just... Uh, totally damning myself. I mean, it's possible that I'm totally damning myself. 
You know, for a pre-alpha game, it really is top-notch. I am super excited. I know they've been selling excellently on Steam, but I am really excited to see how uh, the forest develops and, and becomes a, a more fleshed out and uh, perfect version of itself. Right, let's grab up the rest of these logs. We'll just try to stockpile over on our island as much as possible. I mean, this is a live stream, so unfortunately you're, uh, you're condemned. Oh shit. Oh shit. Don't let me die. Don't let me die. Don't let me die. Don't let me die. Fuck no. Fuck no. Oh god damn it. Now, we're in some shit here. Because, generally what happens when you die the first time is you're brought to this cave. And it kind of sucks. Uh, because they expect you initially to die um, fighting dudes. Hey, there's my logs. <laughs> that's, that's good. Uh, they're pretty useless here. What's up, body parts? How you living? I can see my... F Holy shit, that is like revolutionary for a goddamn game. I can see my feet. I can see my feet moving as I walk. Alright, uh, so yeah, what I was saying was that they, they kind of expect you to, um... to be kidnapped by the, the strange, creepy fucking dudes all the time. And you may be, and you may not be, uh, who knows? I got, I got a flare gun, that's good. But, um, but sometimes you're not going to be. And sometimes you're just going to fucking die. And that's what happens. You just fucking die sometimes. Oh, also, all your buddies from the airplane are up here. You may see in the lower left hand corner so and so out of 130 passengers found. Yeah. It's all my friends. This place looks a lot brighter than I remember it being when I was last here. Okay. Uh, so what we want to do is make our way out. I do. I think they patched the game. Uh, because it's much brighter than it used to be. Alright. we got to find the way north. Up. Control the crouch. I think it's right here, actually. Excellent. Beautiful. Now, there are some motherfuckers up top. We're going uphill. I don't know if you can see this. But we are. We're going uphill, and, uh... We're about to enter this little cave system. And there's a motherfucker up here. He's got, like, a searchlight on his head. And I thought that, you know, maybe that meant we would get a searchlight. Like, maybe he stole it from a miner... Or something, you know? But no. That's not the case. There's like two or three of them up here, I think. And, uh... We're probably dead, honestly. They're probably gonna kill us. I hope not. I gotta tell you, that sound, that Kubricky, uh... Shining 2001 sound... Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. I'm, s I'm honestly scared. Oh fuck! There it is. There he is. There he is. There he is. Two of them. Two of them. Two of them. Two of them. Fuck you. Fuck you. Fuck you. Go away. Go away. There's three of them. Oh my god. The fucking the tension in this game is goddamn ridiculous when it gets down to it. No, go away. Go away. Oh my god. And the worst part is they give you no fucking reason for this. They just drop you here in this this world where it's just assholes <laughs> oh my god I, I think I have to go around that corner where those fucking guys were like why 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 are you doing this to me? where are they oh there oh they can't get me they can't get me thank god oh I can kinda pick at them though uh, that's all I'll do. I'm just gonna pick at him until they're all dead. I th that's probably the only way to do it. Fuck you, dude. Fuck you. Get away from me. No, get away from me. Don't come up behind me. Don't come up. 
Oh, look, look behind me. Oh my god. Oh my god. No one's there. Okay. No, they're behind me. I know. I know. I know. It. Where are they? I, I hear their disgusting feet. Okay, we can do this. We can just, just pick them off like this. A little bit. 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 Yes. Alright, we're gonna get them. We're gonna get them. There's only three of them here. We'll just slowly whittle them away with our with our axe. We'll be okay. Everything will be fine. Oh my god. Alright, looks like we killed one of them. Great. We gotta be working the other two down a little bit. Uh, we are covered in blood. We can get sick here and uh, and and basically die from infection if we're not careful. Alright, this motherfucker. We, come on, light that lighter, motherfucker. Oh my god. Alright, we're just gonna get right in this crevasse and deal with them. They're running away now. This guy's trying to run away. He's doing a shitty job of it. Fuck you. We're just gonna murder him. Fuck you, buddy. You're done. Oh, no. Nope. His buddy's coming back to help. His buddy's coming back to help. <coughs> I mean, like, they gotta be really friggin' tough. They are taking a hell of a beating. No, we're dead. We're probably dead. We're dead. Oh no. No, go away. Go away. Go away right now, please. Go away right now, please. Shit, we're dead. Shit, we're dead. One day. One day is all we lasted. <sighs> well, this has been a short live stream. I've been uh, Culpable Thumb. This has been um, The Forest. I'll probably play more of this again on other live streams. I only played for uh, 20 minutes or so tonight. Uh, but I'll probably end up playing more. Uh, if you want to see me play something else, let me know. Check me out on YouTube, youtube.com slash thumb. Check me out on Twitter, at thumb. And uh, I hope you enjoyed uh, hanging out with me. If not, I don't know, go watch somebody else. Adios, kids. Thank you.